Hey guys, Lemonite Grape here, and welcome to a new video of Retail Tycoon 2. And so, from where we left off last, last video, we have made a lot of, well, a lot of progress, but we're not currently making the main construction of our building right now, because I need more money of course, and so... As, it's, as you see behind me, we have made a lot of progress, I would say, by using a money make layout. The layout's pretty simple. It's just selling small, um, small electronics. I'm planning on moving to large ones so that I can, of course, make more money. I might do that in the future. I also bought myself a semi truck so that if I'm going down to the dock, I can load up more stock into my truck. It's pretty amazing. So, yeah, the layout consists of I think 16 parking spaces and then two self two checkouts and then we have the plants here because you of course want your rating to be higher so that i believe it brings in more customers but i'm not sure i currently name my shop tesco target or food co of course that's changed i know so i added these storage um storage compartments so that I can just have more storage just in case but right now I'm like I think I'm just gonna generate about 2 million cash and then I'll probably change to a better money making layout and when I've got a few million well 20 million I'm not sure. then I'll probably start constructing my shop that what I want but since we don't have the game pass we can't do the biggest shop in the world which is fine so yeah currently the latest update is that they made a bigger map, I'm pretty sure. I mean, yep, they made a bigger map. And then they did some. And then you can sell your trucks, which is actually what I should do. And then they fixed NPCs getting stuck in moving objects. And also NPCs disappearing when wandering. And then they increase performance in stores with many shells. So like if you got loads of like stack shells and stuff, it doesn't cause too much lag. So it's good for not AFK people. They also added a read out of your network on to see people's network relatable which is pretty cool oh they added something which is very useful for less lag is that if um, like someone it doesn't render shelf items past a certain distance if I was all the way down there it wouldn't render stuff from here so that doesn't cause too much lag is actually pretty handy you know what I think did I change thinking of going exercise equipment or large appliances. Uh, 
but now weight machine elliptical and exercise bike okay let's buy treadmill sorry about the music being muted in this game i didn't realize the music is Right. Oh, this. Uh, not sure we find it. Well, they might have not added it in the game right now, which makes sense. I think they have large appliances. Uh. Yeah, I believe they have large appliances. So we can change the large appliances. Which is about a $400 difference. So we need three shelves. By the way, this layout will probably change in the next video because probably gonna look on youtube and find a very good sustainable one and i stock the shells with large electronics but then the manager should be buying larger track large electronics and then hopefully customers come in wanting um, electronics like TVs and stuff. But we have a lot of people just browsing. Oh yeah, should I go down I should go down to the docks and buy some. I should go down and buy some stock. And hopefully I'll be back to you updated to you when in the future so that I should hopefully see if it works or not. I don't know what I'm doing. Really hard with a large vehicle such as the semi. Right, there we go. Let's go. Yeah, so if you're starting now, if you didn't know, you should start on selling um you should start of course you start on canned foods which is all right for the time but you should slowly but surely move on to i believe it's so I, yeah move i moved on to toys which then allowed me to get like a few like fifty thousand in about 12 hours and then i slowly but surely move on to small electronics and then of course i use the manager for it okay. so yeah we've got about oh yeah i forgot i need to deliver the stuff ah domex here And then, if you have time, if you're not AFK, it's always a good thing to check out other people's, other people's plots so that you can get a little bit of inspiration. And also, you should most definitely check out your videos. They help a lot. What about 100 stocks? I wish we could sell like stuff in our store inventory. 
So, sell your vehicles. It sells for being at least like 50% of the price. Hey. I don't know what's going on with chat. But yeah, that's pretty much it. For like, our current progress on Retail Tycoon 2. I'll be of course AFKing more. And of course, getting more money so that I can eventually build a Tesco target off of it. And yeah. This was just a short, well, this was just a medium sized update video. So, if you guys and girls have enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And I see you in the next video. And there should be a video about Pet Simulator X coming soon. So, go check it out.